Robin Hood England was ruled by a noble king Richard King Richard had to go on war so his younger brother Prince John started ruling John was a cruel man he and his sheriff imposed heavy taxes on poor people those who were unable to pay taxes were thrown in prison their farms and houses were taken away by john and sheriff under prince john's rule rich became very rich and poor became poorer and homeless robin hood was a young boy who lived in sherwood forest near nottingham england he grew up watching all this he was a great archer he decided to help the people he knew it was impossible to fight against prince john's army so he decided to use guerrilla tactics to help poor people he made small groups of people who would often rob rich merchants who traveled by sherwood forest he would then distribute the money and other valuables amongst the poor robin hood became famous among the poor people as well as the rich people merchants were scared to travel by the forest all the merchants gathered in prince john's palace to complain about robin hood prince john asked the sheriff to look into the matter sheriff gathered his men and searched into sherwood forest for robin hood but they failed to find him on the other hand robin hood and his men continued to rob merchants as well as prince john's people who collected taxes from poor prince john announced a handsome reward for robin hood's arrest but in vain the sheriff was aware of robin hood's archery skills so he came up with a plan to catch him sheriff arranged an archery competition he was sure that robin hood would definitely participate robin hood told his friend little john i will definitely participate in the archery competition his friend little john warned him that it was a plan laid by the sheriff to trap him everybody knows that you are a great archer robin so you don't need to go and prove anything to anyone oh little john i know it's a trap but we will change our appearances so that nobody will recognize us the next day robin hood along with his friend little john and few other men reached nottingham to participate in the competition as robin hood had changed his appearance nobody could recognize him one by one people took their chance at the archery competition now it was robin hood's turn to shoot the arrow he took aim and hit the target He took 3 shots and all of them hit the target. The crowd started shouting and cheering for the unknown archer. Sheriff immediately told his men, "He is Robin Hood. Nobody can hit the target like him. Arrest him immediately." On sheriff's command, his men arrested Robin Hood. Prince sentenced him to death but little john and his other men suddenly attacked prince john and put a sword on his neck they demanded to release robin hood prince john told the sheriff to release robin hood robin hood and his friends returned to sherwood safely one day 
Robin Hood and his friends were sitting in the forest. They saw a group of old people passing by. They were carrying gold with them. Robin Hood stopped them. The old people said, "This gold is for King Richard. We are his friends." Robin Hood let the people pass and said, "Anyone who is King Richard's friend is my friend." One of the old man removed his traveling hood. He was King Richard himself. Robin Hood and his men were happy to see the king. They told him how his brother and sheriff were troubling the poor people. King Richard said, "I have heard some stories about them. Now that I am back, I will take things in my own hands." King Richard along with Robin Hood reached Nottingham and arrested the cruel prince and the sheriff. King Richard thanked Robin Hood for taking care of his people. Robin Hood promised to help the king whenever he needed. Robin Hood and his people returned to Sherwood happily. Hi, I'm sure you enjoyed watching this video. Please click on the subscribe button to subscribe to our channel and watch more interesting videos.